Hello everyone, Samantha here. I pray all is well with you. This video is um, an art therapy video and um, I pray that somebody that likes creativity, maybe they'll be inspired by it. Sometimes I just like to play with paint and different, you know, art mediums like ink, modeling paste, or gesso and all of that. And it may not be Bible journal. It's not Bible journaling. Sometimes I'll include like scriptures and stuff in it and quotes, positive quotes. Um, but even if it's not like Bible journaling, I can still, I still meditate on the Lord as I'm doing it because it's therapeutic for me. And I'm not a concrete artist. When I try to, I can draw some things by observation, but when I try to like focus so much on perspective and all that stuff and being concrete with the art, I get stressed out and I'm like, no, I'm sorry. I can't do this. I, it's not flowing naturally for me. So I like mixed media art because you can be you can do abstract art and i just really like that i like sometimes a grungy look the chat the what they call it um shabby chick um if i'm saying it right um you know that meet make whole mixed medium sculptures clay and all of that so um i did a page in this journal i got this journal like almost i think like a year ago um rita Bar barakat hold on one second the light is on a timer hold on yeah, Berita Barakat and Creativation 2000, I think it was 18, um, she had this journal. But I got it, I think it was last year. I painted this in the front. Avant-garde means non-traditional, unorth unorthodox. So it's like really different. That's And I like the term avant-garde when I'm doing like mixed media art. So um, I'm going to, I pray that you are inspired, like, you know. Um, if you're someone that, you know, you need an outlet or whatever, sometimes if you might like paint, you might, you know, don't get caught up in whether you're a concrete artist, just have fun and, you know, it's just so much that you can do with mixed media art. So anyway, what I used in here, I used some dis distress oxides and I used some distress inks. I used some washi tape. Um, also, I use uh, my memento ink uh, for some stamping. I use this stamp. I only use one stamp. I've had this stamp for some time, and I've been wanting to use it. It's old books, a uh, old books border. I really like this because I like the, you know, the old look, the old look of the books. And I use some um, intense blocks, Derwent. I use some gesso. I use some. Mod Podge. That's all that I really use in this. And you're going to see like it looks it's unorthodox. It's different. And I just, it's just, it wasn't uh, like, oh, it had to be a purpose. It was just fun. Just to have fun. That's it. So I just pray that you just enjoy the video if you watch it. And um, I want to say, I'm going to be back at the end. I'm going to be back at the end. Okay. Bye-bye. Not bye-bye, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I want to mention that there is a giveaway in the video. At some point, I'm going to share the giveaway. All right now.
this is the giveaway I'm giving away one of these stamps I got these off almost like 80 to 90 percent off and I was like oh my goodness I'm gonna get two so I can give one away I think they're so nice and so if you would like the stamp if you would like to participate in that giveaway just go ahead and put in the description in a comment in a the comment section the stamp <laughs> don't put in it's the stamp okay so that's it if you would like to participate or you can email me at glory express at gmail.com the stamp i've had people emailing me and i i'm glad that i did that because i i said i know some people do not want to put in in the comment section or you know whatever it is Every, some people just don't want to do that for whatever reason and it's okay so you can if you want to participate in the giveaway for the stamp you can put you can email me again glory expressed at gmail.com and put in put in the subject area the stamp okay so back to the video
So as you can see, in the process, it was really messy. I got my hands messy. I had fun. I like it. And it's it's no it doesn't have to be rhyme or reason it's just i wanted to play that's it i just wanted to play and i wanted to play with this you know when we kids we want to play with our markers we want to draw stuff we want to have fun doesn't mean that we can't do it when we get older and then i colored these pages because i'm going to do something with these I, not colored but i put some you know ink on these pavement pages and i'm gonna come back and do something with it i like this ripped look i like that it looks like that and i'm gonna be ripping up pages and doing things in here and putting things down i already have some ideas for this page with for some different kind of things that i want to put on my page here where i that i've never done on my video but oh i got an idea and i'm gonna try it so you know just have fun if you're someone that likes art and like paints and stuff like that but then you say to yourself you know oh but i can't draw it's okay like everybody's not that kind of there's so many different types of types of art um and there's drawing and then there's the category of art and in the category of art drawing can fit in that category but then you have painting you have sculpturing you have so many different things so i pray that you are blessed by this video and with that being said i want to say thanks for watching god bless you and remember jesus loves you bye bye